Hey, hey, good day. What's up? What's poppin'? It's your girl, Magical Virgin, and I'm back with another reading. So this is our weekend vibes, y'all. Like, what's good for the weekend? What's poppin'? What y'all feeling? What y'all doing? What y'all getting into, right? So, um, as always, everything has been saged, prayed over, the decks being used are on display. So, let's dive in. This spread will be a little different than usual because I'm trying to make it a little shorter. So, I think we're just going to pull three from each deck. Let's put this down so that you guys can see it. So, um, without any more interruptions, <laughs> let's get going, y'all. All right, Spirit. We can vibes. Like, what's going on? What's popping? Like, are we getting to the point? Are we partying? Like, what's going on for the weekend? The collective here, Spirit. You know who will be guided to watch this recording, this video, this reading, Spirit. On the table, please. Let's go. Woo. Too many, too many, too many. I'm not going to take all those. This one at this time is good. Thank you. The rider. Mm. Another. <clears throat> the cloud. We got that one last time too. Mm. The ship. <clears throat> Weekend vibes. It looks like a lot of y'all are riding out. You got the rider paired with the ship. Right? Meeting up with somebody. This could be a spot. Right? With that eye. That's a spot. The rider. The ship. Some of y'all going to be put in that position to be that ride or die chick, right? Somebody's going to hit you up because they've seen something and they want you to ride out with them. So be careful with this energy because this, this ship is coming toward. These, these guys are going toward each other. So I don't know. Something's definitely getting popping here. This is definitely a meetup. Somebody's definitely ready to serve for real. Give me more on this rider spirit. What's going on? We can buy it. Hmm. God of Pentacles. Hmm. Son of Cups. Ace of Wands with the ships. Yeah, some, I mean, <clears throat> this is definitely going out. Some of these guys are going to house parties, cookouts. I don't know if it's nice out. I don't know where y'all from, where y'all live at. <clears throat> we got a pentacles, right? Some of y'all riding out to collect some bread from somebody. The rider. Again, be careful of being that ride or die chick because um, the ride or die chick is someone who will do anything for someone, right? No matter how this person is treating them or how this place is treating them, they're just going to ride it out. But this is the God of Pentacles, so it can't be that bad. Maybe some of these guys are riding a situation out. Um, you're waiting for your money. You're waiting for funds to get cleared. So that you could be on your way somebody, somewhere with this cloud. Um, in the ship. So tra definitely traveling. You know. Eye cloud. Plane. Right? Being up in the clouds. Bird's eye view. So some of y'all are definitely traveling. Going on vacation somewhere. <clears throat> You know, 
uh, drinking, you got the cup there, smoking, you got your wands, your three rolls, right? Weekend vibes, riding out the ships, meeting up with someone, the spot at the spot. It's also saying like there's opportunities coming to someone. Your ships are coming in, you know, because uh, with the wands, the ten of wands is usually seen as a burden, right? Something that's weighing heavy on your head or weigh, weighing heavy on your shoulders, right? But uh, with this particular deck with the ten of wands for me, this is a hustler. This is somebody who's hustling. This is somebody who's shipping things out. Um, iCloud, right? Packages, iCloud, right? Or uh, internet internet stuff shipping packages um getting packages um <clears throat> some some of y'all are selling pre i don't you know if it's legal in your state some of y'all are doing those type of things infused of few food infused drinks right yeah getting that bread that way your money the rider right yeah Yeah, Son of Cups. It talks about opportunities, the possibilities. Son of Cups, new things. So with this cloud, some of you guys got new visions, new ideas, new, new thoughts. Some of you guys are daydreaming of new possibilities. And with the wands here, um, you could be possibly thinking a little too heavy on it. You're thinking about um, how is it going to work with this shipping and this riding? How am I going to get things done how am i going to um fulfill the fulfill the packages fulfill um orders or you know paperwork right with this iCloud because this is like my computer card too right documents iCloud research iCloud so some of you guys are researching on how to um do some of these things Some of y'all writing out for that D. <laughs> Some of y'all writing out for that D, right? Because look at this, right? The ship, right? Watch what happens when I cut off her head. Come on now. Get with me. Look at that. Look at this. I, come on. I ain't got to say no more. Yeah, you had your eye on it. <laughs> Rider. <laughs> yes. The God of Cups. I mean, the God of Pentacles. Yeah, this is this might be on somebody who got it. Um, you know, this might be something new. You got your eye on this person. This this God of Pentacles. This is somebody who got their shit together. Um, they a hustler of some sort. Or you might, you know, for some of them they are hustlers, and some of them they got um. What how they call it? What they call it? They come in with packages, luggage, or whatever. They come with um, bags. I don't know. Burdens. Yeah. A rider. All right. So this this is. I might I might pull more than each. I don't know. Let's see. Let's get more on this rider here. Got a pentacle of spirit. The eye cloud definitely got your eye on this cup. These possibilities, something new. It's a little very your judgment here is a little cloudy on this person. I don't know if they come, they're coming with um luggage, heavy baggage. But some of these guys got your eye on this person. And you you know you want them to come towards you, but you're you're ready to go toward them. For some of y'all, you're thinking about a dream or something that you want to start doing. For some of these guys, you already have jumped into this. If you have not already, this is something that's going to bring you um, abundance with this um, God of Pentacles. And the fact that this is a male on this card, it doesn't mean anything. If you're fit, if you're a female, this just means that you're in that energy of um, that go-getter energy, right? The rider, yeah. The weekend vibes, yeah, chilling. Hmm. Give us more. We can vibe the writer spirit. To 
way too many. Still too many spirits. Just one for the writer, please. We can vibes. Ace of Swords, yep. Action, movement, thoughts, clarity on a situation, right? Ace of Swords, clarity, wanting to take action towards something. Uh, for, for some of you guys, like I said, this is um, something that you've been working on, a creative project, or wanting to go to school, something that you want to fulfill that's, um, that's for your future, that's going to bring you money, right? Son of Cups, something, something that you've been wanting to do. Ten of Wands, hustle. Um, waiting for this to come in. This could be a new job. Um, anything that you're creating to bring abundance to you. Um, future abundance as well, you know. Uh, Ace of Wands. This could be a person too. Mm, the Hermit with the Cloud. Yeah, again, in your thoughts, daydreaming, thinking, wondering, um, calculating, hermits. Um, trying to figure out the path The hermits, right? Um... I don't know how you being the writer and the hermit at the same damn time, but you, you're doing it. <laughs> so um, I think these thoughts right here for some of these guys, especially with this Ace of Swords, is kind of like just that a little bit of fear. Or maybe the hermit is just you being in isolation at this time because you are working toward a goal or you, you got your eye on somebody. You know what I'm saying? You're, you're just trying to figure out how to get to that person. The hermit, right? Ace of Swords. Ship spirit, yep, King of Cups. Bringing in fulfillment here. Remember how I said for some of these guys, this is a, a a male that you're waiting on. King of Cups, God of Pentacles. This is somebody who um is gonna fulfill you emotionally and um mental, emotional, and financial gain. King of Cups coming in with this ship. The hermit, having your eye on somebody, thinking of someone. Wondering how the ship packages. The Hermit, King of Cups, right? Being committed to the situation, King of Cups, right? Being committed, the writer being down, King of Cups, right? The ship, King of Cups, the Hermit. Being into what you're doing, being into what you're creating, going for it. Right, Ace of Swords, clarity, the rider, writing it, writing it out, doing what needs to be done, getting things done. So yeah, for the weekend, a lot of y'all are getting things done. This is creative projects. Um, this is making phone calls, ship, you know, with the ship and the rider, the cloud. This is networking, communicating with other people, the hermit, isolation, research, thought, reflection iCloud, Hermit, Isolation, iCloud, Dreaming, Thinking, Thought. Look at this, y'all. Come on now. iCloud, the Hermit. This is somebody who's thinking and reflecting on how to get what they need, how to get what they want. And um, with this Ace of Swords and this Rider, you ain't going to give up on um, this God of Pentacles here. Whether this is um a job opportunity, a creative project, or a person, or whatever this is. Whatever this means to you, this money, this happiness, God of Pentacles, right? So that's basically the King of Pentacles in the traditional decks. That would be the King of Pentacles. So somebody has clarity on this King of Pentacles as well. Because they've seen something on this eye cloud, right? Hermit, isolation, researching with this cloud. They've seen this cup. They've seen opportunity. They've seen possibilities, right? Or they could have seen this got a cup offering opportunities to somebody, but I doubt it. Yeah, I think this is this might be a new situation that somebody I got your eye on. Because the Sun of Cups and then the King of Cups, right? The ship coming in. This is this new hustle coming into you. That's going to bring you this, this money. God of Pentacles. Spirit. Nine of Wands. 
usually um the nine of wands is usually like an action card or it's like a stand in your ground card um for sometimes for me this this person just looks like they're not confident and they look like they're protected or being protected hmm you got this a little harder I think this is being protected. This this Ace of Swords. I think this is um. If this is something pertaining that to what you're creating, I think you're protecting this idea, this thought. You're protecting it. Um, if this is a person, you're 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 not letting them know that you like them. You're just spying on them on the internet. You're dreaming of this person bringing this cup of love to you. Um, emotional and physical, you know, King of Cups, right? We all know the King of Cups is emotional and commitment. And then when I do that, look, <laughs> yo, y'all nasty. <laughs> y'all are nasty. <laughs> but yeah, y'all waiting for that. And um, but you're you're kind of I don't know if this person's got their guard up. Um, I don't know. Nine of nine of wands. Definitely, this is something that's being protected. Or maybe you don't see this person's coming into you because this is something new, right? Son of Cups, a new possibility. You could be so focused on your own dream and the things that you want for yourself that you don't even see this new person coming into you. That's for some. That's for some of y'all. For others of y'all, this is your dream. This is you know the things that fulfill you, um, make you stable inside the uh, physical world. This is your money, um, your worldly possessions, right? This is your home, your job, your career. You've had some type of enlightenment. You have some type of clarity, some type of thought um, that you're sticking to with this and you're protecting it. You're standing, you're standing within the situation. You're not gonna um you're not budging. So there's definitely a situation here that you're not budging on, something that you've gotten clear thought on. Mm -hmm. Seven of Wands with this opportunity. Hmm. Nine of Wands, Seven of Wands. Ace of Wands, wow, on top of the Ten of Wands. So this is your hustle. And for some of you guys, this is your hustle. For some of y'all, it's that D. <laughs> it's definitely that D. You know what I'm saying? Bring it, you know? Bringing it to you with the emotion, the ship, right? So this is something definitely romantic, definitely something very sexual for me. I don't know why I'm picking that up, but even with the seven of wands, um, you might feel like this person has um, uh, other offers or something, or giving their their wands away. Uh, let's see, seven of wands is usually like uh, Well, again, if you're sitting here protecting and standing within your um your thoughts and your clarity, your truth here, and then with the seven of wands, um, with the cup, the possibilities and this cup of love, this offer, for some of y'all, I think you're fighting for this. But this is something new. Or you're seeing that this person's fighting off others. Other people want this same cup. Other people, this might be something new. Other people, you see that other people with this eye cloud and this hermit. Yep, isolation, looking shit up research. Yep, you see that this person has other possibilities. They have other opportunities out there. And you might feel like seven of wands. You might feel like this is something that you're going to have to fight for. Ten of wands, you know, that's the burden. That's the package. And then ace of wands, though. Ace of Wands with the cup. This is something that you really want. That's for those of you who, who want a person. You really want this person. This is somebody new. You might have not had made a move yet. And for others of you, this is a dream. And you feel like um possibilities. Uh, there might be comp competition, seven of wands. There's competition within the same field that you're looking up or researching on, right? There's other people that do the same thing. All those fish, right? Other people, some of cups. There's other people that do this same thing that you do. The same 
hustle. But it doesn't matter, you know, Ace of Wands. It doesn't matter that others do the same hustle. There's room for everybody to grow. Not everybody's you. Everybody has their own uniqueness and what they do, right? King of Cups, bringing in that fulfillment. The ship. So, yeah. Okay, well, that has been your weekend vibes, y'all. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Magical Virgin, over and out.